I thought I'd mention something about a fear I, I had from time to time in recent months because uh, others may be uh, experiencing the same fear and coming to the same conclusions about it. Um, sometimes I would think that that I'm coming along too slowly and everybody else is like uh, is doing okay with ascension and with like reintegrate, reintegrating soul fragments and uh, uh, healing soul wounding and uh, feeling pure love all the time and then I would I would fear that I was falling behind and that I might not make the grade <laughs> pass fail system you know <laughs> and uh, and so every time I asked the divine about that the, the answer that I would get was uh, that that there was just enough time for each of us that it was all planned out for for each of us and that I need have no fears along those lines because my path it was my path and and it's been carefully uh, carefully the timetable has been carefully set and there are those who will help me to achieve it and I like that so then that fear would be laid to rest right and then I had another fear it was oh my god you know it was oh my god I've spun off into an alternate universe <laughs> And it's not going to make the grade. The whole universe is not going to make the grade. And I'm going, God, how did I get this kind of luck? You know? <laughs> and so I thought about it for a while. And the reason it came up is because I was going through all kinds of nightmare scenarios and uh, like, a, um, like mental stories were just flooding past me as, as if they were coming from the whole world through my heart and through my mind and out into outer space someplace and just like dissolving <laughs> and and I was thinking God this is not like New Earth this is a lot this is a lot different you know and, and it got on my nerves after a while it was like one fear coming up and dissipating another terrible scenario fear dissipating and and finally I thought you know it's never gonna end <laughs> and so um Finally, I just I just hauled myself up by my boot, bootstraps and said, I don't care if I'm living in planet, uh, what's it called, planet, planet B or not, you know. Somewhere in the universe, there's a new Earth. And the people there are going to make a wonderful go of it. And it will be, it will uplift the whole universe, what, what our human beings are doing there. And if my, if my line peters out, and if I go directly to source, I mean, that's the thing that every extraterrestrial, every advanced being really wants to do. And so what's, what's the big deal here? I'm going, you know, I did my part, I'm sure of that. And the minute I said that, the strange thing was, the minute I admitted that I had this terrible fear and that, uh, that, I, that I had done the wrong thing and I was going the wrong way and everybody with me you know the minute I did that I dimed up multi dimed up and into a, like a feeling of love consciousness interesting these times huh so but I've heard people say you know maybe the world will end in a terrible solar blast or nuclear war or something like that and everything will end and that'll be that right and the reason we feel that way sometimes you know we have those concerns and those fears is because it's because we're processing a lot of deep cellular fears. So we come up with these notions of catastrophe. Now, um, so along the lines of, of, of um, what's it called, um, a solar flare, like the kind of solar flare that wipes out a life on Earth, that kind of solar flare, I, I'd like to say that I have, I have the guidance that I get, the intuition that I have, uh, from high at the highest is that the solar flares are uh, com are very carefully um, timed to the to the nanosecond and to every little bit of of all of the incoming energy is is timed for our benefit by the divine. Maybe step down through intermediaries like like they say, you know, ETs are like that. Christ did ETs. We're talking without bodies, you know, higher than us. 
and it could be that they're, they're all out there helping us too as agents of the divine, of, of the divine Christ love and light. I can't say for sure, but a lot of people say that so. But I do know that the divine itself is taking care of all that. And so we not, need not fear some, some senseless act of violence on the part of the divine. The divine is taking care of each soul, each one of us, as if it were it, the divine itself.